I like that animation. Now we can heal while running. Also a useful Dang. skill. Oh, we got Sid. Nice to meet you, buddy. Yeah, it's definitely the cult then. So much easier. I'm so happy. Oh, I'm so happy. All right, heal it up. Wait for my force to come back so I don't jump like two s feet and go. There we go. See, for some reason they added these guys to like the you know non-imperial repertoire. I don't know why they're here. I mean, we had plenty of diversity. I mean, it was all aliens for crying out loud. And then they throw this in and it's all... No, what's it called? Oh, what? You're kidding me. I have to go all do that all again? Oh, man. And these cutscenes aren't Jan skippable, the too. Way right in the oh, you hit enter. Okay. I yeah, will do this real quick. Stop. Enter is the button. It used to be control. Someone there? Man, they really change it up. How do I turn that off? How do I turn it off? Asks Jaden, our protagonist. Yeah, see, I missed back to you can just hit B and get all your health back. But now, you have to use things like the force to help you. They saw that stupid... I've been hit! At least now they make him sound like C-3PO. Before it was like... Nah, 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 nah. Well done, guys. I'm glad you guys had enough attention to detail to notice that your C-3PO sounded nothing like C-3PO. Just gonna pay him back to the things I had to endure. Alright. You, there you go. And eat. Ran the gullet. And we got the Sith guy. That sounds like Kyle, actually. That was really pretty classy. Alright. I've noticed. We've been saving a lot of things from blowing up. I guess that's like an initiate thing, you know? Like when you become a Jedi, your first task is keep things from blowing up. And you, as, as you'll see later on down the line, task becomes blow things up. You see these are this is all official Jedi stuff, you know, it's the ranks. Everyone goes through this. I mean Luke was special, he got to skip a few classes. He went straight to blowing things up with the Death Star, but see he almost killed me again. Must be a lucky shot. Do you read? I read you, John. I thought he just said. I don't know what he just said. Who's talking? Evan Hawk. Now the Evan Hawk was the uh, Kotor ship. Kyle's ship is the Raven's Claw, I think. How can I get through there? Ow. Which is ironic because I think the company that made this and of course bowcasters are tricky because you can't really block them with your lightsaber so anyway what was I talking about? I don't know oh well there it goes if you haven't noticed that happens to me a lot I'll be talking about a topic and then 
Out the brain it goes. Tragic, really. It's like, let's play Alzheimer's. Terrible disease. Yeah, there it is again. And there's a guy in Star Wars named John. How generic can you get? Now my throat is closing up. No, it's not really. It's just... Had something caught in my throat, but I'm alright now. Alright, note to self. How can I get through there? Well, first of all, you could stand back here and shoot all these things. So you don't get hurt. And that because of you, I have to stand ten feet from a Rodian. Because of you, I cry every time I think of Notre Dame. Because of you, all I can see of Gorilla is a stram. Not any of the planets. Let me just go down there. Yeah, see that sounded like a Sith. You know, the ha 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 ha, the mocking laughter they do. Were they really that short for voice work? Yeah, they were like, hey, hey, a guy who plays Kyle, could you play like a Sith guy too for like, ow, 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 like one scene? And being the cool guy, he's like, sure, I'll do it. I'll save because I don't like that sniper up there. Yeah, unlike the last game, there's no like pretty little pictures of where you left off. It's all just kind of the level title and like a blank generic you know, Star Wars planet thing. But hey, what you gonna do? Focus is a good stuff, man. I like it. Should use them more. All right, there's a bomb. Let's see a bomb. Let's go. Checkpoint. All right. Wow, there's a bomb on the Yeah, just disarm it. Disarm it quickly. Disarm it. Disarm it. That took two seconds. That wasn't so bad. Yeah. Okay. Mission Maybe they made it too easy. That doesn't sound good. Bad news, Chief. The tram is speeding up. I think they're going to ram it into the station. We have to get the control to stop that train. Stop that train! Stop that train! Alright. Uh, we're almost there, I think. I mean, there's gotta be some more. Alright, run, 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 run. Heal. Good. Oh, I see why. Got another one of those things. I think there was actually a weak way. Kyle was telling his hilarious story. Back in the this mission. <coughs> Pardon me again. I wish you just kind of told that story. I would. Come get me, Jedi. Oh, oh, shoot. I would love that. I want to know what part of the weak way, Jam Punch. What is he doing? Some sort of interpretive Sith dance? Is the wall there? Alright. Alright. A little nervous to go actually attack him. Maybe he's harder than the last one, who knows. Now there are a lot of mods which really kind of up lightsaber fighting, but... I don't know, I like mods, but I mean they're part of the reason why the PC is the best system ever. But I don't know, I don't like to use them for let's playing because I like to show it off you know, how it was or how it is or how it will be. And here we go, stop the tram! Great work, Jake. Great work! I took out those ships, so I think we're in the clear. Sweet deal, man, sweet deal.
Excellent work on the tram. It's lucky you two showed up when you did. If that tram had exploded in the city, it could have killed I thousands of people. I saved thousands of people. I have some troubling news. While Kyle and I attended to the crash shuttle, someone broke into my quarters and sliced into my records. R2 is trying to figure out what they may be looking for. Well, that would only be troubling if he found the, you know, special editions of <laughs> the Star Wars movies in that. Oh, great. So, how's your training going? I've been sent on a few errands, nothing exciting. Same here. I guess that's just how the training works. I thought it was just me. Ever wonder if your master is holding you back? You know, making sure you don't become too powerful? <laughs> Why would you say that? Well, Kyle doesn't seem to really foster my talents. I've gone on a couple of missions with him, but he doesn't let me do any of the really important stuff. Hmm. Maybe he's observing you. You know, seeing how you accomplish your missions. I wouldn't worry about it. I'm not so sure. What do you think, Jaden? Well, I... Ready to get back out there? 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 Did I interrupt something? No, not at all. Well, I'm ready. Let's go. And the point of that scene was? I don't know. All right, so we'll uh, we'll start mer nah, we'll start merchant rescue. That's what we'll start off next time with. It'll be the double M episode because I'm not doing droid recovery. So let's start it, and then we'll uh, get this it off. This should be an easy assignment. I think you can handle it while Kyle is away with Rush. Take a shuttle, land at the coordinates of the distress beacon, and pick up any survivors. Done, man. All right, so now we're maxed up on healing juice. And so apparently some merchant dudes crashed and stuff, and we have to go save them. Good for us, right? Important Jedi business. We are the best pilot ever. Nice work, Jaden. Some rescue mission. And I love how they landed conveniently next to the merchant ship they went to pick up. It's one of those great ironies of life. Hello? Hello? Hey, you there. Thank the force you've come. This place is... Oh! Uh. Dude, your goose is about to get cooked. There goes the goose. What was that? Yeah, this level, it's pretty memorable. Everyone who's played this game kind of looks back on this level and shudders a little, but we'll, uh, we'll explore that desolate wasteland next time on Let's Play Jedi Academy with your host, Wes. And I'm a copy of Game Informer from three years ago.